Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the National Corvette Museum. Good morning everyone. Happy, what is today? Thursday? Happy Thursday. Yay. So I'm going to go out today and I'm going to be pretty optimistic compared to what happened last night. If you didn't see why last night was bad, click right here. I'll put a link to that video. Yeah, it was, I don't know. I'm gonna be optimistic and I'm gonna say everything is fine, everything is good, everything is well, and that the storm bounced onto that other side of town. That would be great, but I don't think it did. But I'm gonna be optimistic about it. You have to be optimistic. You have to be optimistic. So, I have, I have coffee, and yeah, so, let's start our adventure. Yay! In Bowling Green, Kentucky. 20th anniversary here. It a beautiful thing. And those go all the way over to there. So, from what I understood, oh, there's actually some over there too, on the other side of the road. And there's the big Corvette logo. There's the, what's called the Sky Dome. Um, give you a little information about the museum. The museum is located right off on exit 28 in Bowling Green, Kentucky on I-65 and they host an event every year for their Hall of Fame which is really really nice and there is a lot of Corvettes this one being the 20th year 20th anniversary they are doing a oh, we gotta switch hands again sorry you guys this being the 20th anniversary I'm gonna find some shade there were doing caravans that were coming in, and the caravans are, there was 29 of them that showed up. And they're estimating at about 5,000 cars that are gonna be coming here. So, in saying that, there's a lot of vets. And I'm in heaven. My favorite model body style is probably going to be that one right there, the yellow one. I love, 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 love the back end of that. Love it. Love that car. And I've tried telling myself that I'm gonna make myself a goal. And within the next five years, I want to own a vet. I've been saying it for a long time now, but you never get anything accomplished unless you actually do it. I can't stop looking at it, it's so pretty. Even looking at it from the side, hang on. Look at this from the side. It's it, it's amazing. See? It's amazing. I absolutely love it. So yeah. But Corvettes everywhere. Love it. The National Corvette Museum is based upon memberships to keep the National Corvette Museum alive. Uh, I'll put a link to the museum below. If you're a Corvette lover or if you'd like to help out with charities and so forth, click on the donate button. Become a member, help them out. They do a lot and especially with what has happened, especially with what has happened over the past couple of, well, in the past year, um, there, where the Sky Dome is at where is where they hold a bunch of the cars. and. Recently, there was a uh, part of it collapsed, the floor did, and a bunch of cars were extremely damaged. So, they have that. Ooh, look at the blue one, you guys. Ain't that pretty? And there's another yellow one. I didn't do it. Look at that one. That one's 
pretty. I still like the yellow. I still like the yellow and I still like the burnt orange. Amazingly. For some reason my phone is going nuts. But yeah. I really enjoy it. And there's part of some cars that are coming in. Ooh, look at the red one. Wait till you see the red one coming in. Where is it? There it is. Look at that one. That's pretty. That's nice. That's nice. So yeah, so here we are at the Corbett Museum, Bowling Green, Kentucky. Yay. Oh, and an update on um, the collateral. So, let me find some place I can walk to without interrupting anybody. Oh my God, it's sweating, it is hot. It's like 95 degrees here, guys. So, I got, got down here, unwrapped all the collateral and everything that I had put up, and none of it was damaged. A couple of the shirts were a little wet, but, because they'd soaked through the box that I brought. But other than that, everything was just peachy. So I was really happy with that, knowing that they weren't hurt. So yeah, if I find anything else, I'll let you guys know. But for right now, a bunch of vets, a bunch of awesome people. Don't forget to go to like and subscribe to the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out a lot. And if you are a car enthusiast and you do like to help out, museums and stuff click on the museums link below go and donate towards the museum to help keep it alive to help them out with these beautiful cars here's another yellow one guys that's pretty So it is 8.30 here, I am in my room, and I am watching that, yay, I'm on your ready to go bed, it's a good day today, minus the rain and the thunder and the lightning right there at the last minute, you guys didn't get to see that, sorry. We were, I was trying to get out of there before lightning hit me and electrocuted me because it would have been bad and stuff. Yeah. So, I'm going to hit the bed and, get, and take a shower and all that stuff. And then, yeah. 
So I will see y'all tomorrow. Until then, catch you on the flip side. Later. Please hang up and try again.